Um, the next segment that we have, uh, it's uh, it's it's kind of a segment for uh, to add a little bit of silliness into the game. Uh, it's what? for any DMs that uh, you know, if you want to give your players a magic item, but you don't want to make them overpowered too early or something like that, um, or even just for some flair. Again, what we talked about earlier with the um, the, the opportunities for role play, right? Um, th those role play pl uh, prompts. It's a lot uh, a lot easier when you have little things like this. Um, so this segment is uh, the useless item of the week. We talked about it last week. So useless. <laughs> we just we determined that last week's item was actually potentially useful, though. Yeah. Yeah. Well, look, look, yeah. Yeah. Indestructible <laughs> endless rope. Bad idea. Moving on. Right. Moving on. So this uh, this week's uh, useless item of the week uh, is from Xanthar's Guide to Everything. It is the Cloak of Billowing. Uh, we'll link it in the description of the YouTube video afterwards. Um, but uh, basically, just while you're wearing the cloak, you can use a bonus action to make it billow dramatically. Like I just picture like the Superman pose on top of the like Daily Planet spinning globe with this cloak cape just waving in the background, right? Totally, yeah, yeah. It's just it's a it's a common you know item. It's not hard to come by. Um, it's it's magical, obviously. Um, but it's it's only ha it only has the one the one item, <laughs> and it's uh, it can add a lot of flair to your uh, your character. Um, you know, you can use a bonus action as you run into battle and make your cloak billow as you <laughs> as you do it, or as you know if you know that the the big bad evil guy is uh, is about to die, you can you can use your bonus action uh, <laughs> uh, uh, and chance and hope that you don't miss <laughs> and See? billow your cloak just before you kill him. <laughs> See, as a DM, like I really do think if you use this at the right time for yeah. like an intimidation check or a persuasion check or something like that, I would definitely give you advantage. Well, there you go. For a well-timed cloak billow, 100% advantage so on something. We're going to have to rename this section to uh, Slightly Useful Item of the Week. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, supposed to be useless item, but for the lulls, why not? Because we're we're zero for two right now on it. <laughs> yeah, at least this one wouldn't like break the world. This is true, um, and that's just a, a side note as well. Um, in in our campaign, um, and I certainly did this in in the one shot that I ran as well. But um, Tilly gave us magic items very very quickly um, because they were fun and exciting. Um, and now after playing for what two years, um, we're you know it is pretty powerful. It is fun, but like, how? Do, excuse me. How do you one up that once you've got a plus one weapon? Well, is it a plus two weapon? Is the plus three weapon then? I mean, where where does it stop? So it's 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 something that I learned to temper to have fun items and not necessarily like stat boosting items because half of D and D, if not more, is is the role play and the fun too, right? Sure. Um, so that's our useless item of the week. <laughs> I like some of the in-game chats min max build with a uh, coca billowing i think we can make one up we'll we'll put our minds to it this week i'm, I'm committed to that 